Ever listen back to a recording of your own voice and immediately want to throw your phone across the room? Why do we sound like movie stars in our heads, but like complete strangers on tape? It's actually simple physics. See, everyone else hears you through air conduction, but you hear yourself in stereo. Sound waves travel through the air and vibrate through the bones of your skull. Your skull is basically a natural subwoofer. Bone is great at conducting low-frequency vibrations, this boosts the bass making your voice sound deeper, richer, and smoother inside your own head. But a microphone? It doesn't care about your bones. It only picks up the airwaves. It strips away all that internal bass leaving you with that higher-pitched tinny sound. Sorry but that's the real you. Psychologists call this voice confrontation, your brain actually glitches out. It recognizes the pattern as you, but the pitch is wrong. It feels like an uncanny valley version of yourself, which triggers that cringe feeling. Feel bad? Don't, even John Lennon hated his voice. He constantly begged his producer to bury his vocals in echo and effects just so he didn't have to hear his raw voice. You're in good company. The good news, your recorded voice only sounds weird to you. To your friends and family, it sounds completely normal because that's how they've heard you their entire lives. So be honest, are you cool with your voice or do you still hate hearing it? Let me know in the comments.